Hello everybody, welcome back to the Driveway Engineer. I'm JR. Uh, today, I'm going to bring a quick update on the progress on my OM617 turbo diesel. Um, I did a bunch of math and I kind of came to the conclusion, if you don't remember, I in the last video I pressed the uh, cylinder liner. Well, I didn't press them out, I beat them out after I welded them. Um, cylinder liners out. I have new ones on the way, they're not here yet. I did a bunch of math that told me that I was going to need something like a 200 with a minimum of a 200 degree Fahrenheit temperature differential I would have two thou of clearance to drop the sleeves in. I thought that that might be fun content to do like an acetone dry ice bath and, and heat it up with a weed eater and everything else but I talked to a couple people one guy in particular the same guy who showed me how to weld the cylinder liners out who said that he got several stuck that way and it just never worked for him I talked to a couple other guys and he told me the same thing that you know they, they tried all the tricks they tried to leave it in the freezer they tried to dry ice and they just heat up too fast the cylinder liners on these are really really thin I mean they're probably I don't know they're less than 10 thou thick so anyway obviously you can see what my solution was here i bought this on facebook marketplace it was listed for 120 dollars it's actually a distant cousin of mine um back in my hometown i wound up getting it for 60 bars so for 60 dollars i couldn't have went and got dry ice and a propane burner and this will actually have other uses i will say that it's a little bit smaller than I anticipated. The thing's only like four feet high. So, but it's got plenty of room to get the block in there. Um, whenever they show up, I will bring you guys back and we'll start pressing them in. Um, that's really it. You know, kind of keep your eye out. This dude bought this back in April and I know, I just know he spent his stimulus money on it and not, you know, admitting that he was in over his head and uh, has lost my gain. So, that's what's going on with the turbo diesel, and uh, later on this week we'll get into, there's actually, you guys can't see, some of these boxes are uh, turbo parts, so we'll go over a quick cheap turbo kit for you guys this week too. So, thanks for watching, be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time on the Driveway Engineer.